Alright, what's going on you guys? It's your boy Starkler coming at you with another video and today I am going to be showing you guys the COO boss fight that is a part of Corporate Clash's April Fool's Day update. It's a small little temporary event that they decided to do and host on this beautiful server, Toontown Corporate Clash. And uh, yeah, uh, in order to get through it you have to get to Boardbot HQ which is through this tunnel right here in front of us. And I'm actually going to show you the walkway to the BoardBot HQ to get to this little boss fight, if you even want to call it a boss fight, because it actually kind of fits the theme of going up a mountain, um, and you're going to see that, and that dog just went through there. Maybe we could do it together. Let's follow him. Um, so yeah, I'm going to show the street walk up there because, um, yeah, like I just said, it kind of fits in with the whole idea of going up a mountain to the very top. And it's also a brand new street design, which looks pretty cool. And, uh, um, you know, it's only going to be around for a couple days, probably. You know, it's like only a one-time thing every year. So it's pretty cool. Um, I like the new design. And I also like the, uh, what are they called, like slopes going up through the through the hill. I don't know where this dog is going. Let's just follow her. Maybe she can come in here with me into the elevator. We're gonna go fight the boss, guys. COO also stands for Chief Operating Officer. I totally didn't Google that, I promise. Um, but yeah, we are on our way. Is that dog coming? Come on, doggy. Yeah, this dog wants to come with me. She wants to fight the boss, too. So yeah, uh, I like the street. Definitely, like, even that alone just feels like amazing new content. Like a brand new street. I like it. Let's go fight this boss together. We're gonna have a random tune with us. And we're gonna sit around for, like, 20 minutes. You know, what's interesting about this is, yeah, like, we made it to BoardBot HQ. So, this is BoardBot HQ. Um, it's literally just an elevator and a couple of walls. Um, but... I kid you not, like, it's cool that we get to see, like, a tiny glimpse of Boardbot HQ, but we also, um, uh, you know, even though, like, we're just gonna stare at this guy talking the whole time, like, I think it actually has to do with, like, the lore of the story, so, yeah, it's funny, like, you go into this elevator as a tune. Okay, good, she didn't hop off. I, I was thinking she was gonna hop off, but she didn't. Um... But yeah, this is it. We're going to go do the COO, which uh, for those who don't know which cog this is, it's the cog th that the chairman stands on to try to make himself look taller. So this is it. This is the boss fight. If you want to call it that, this is it. So yeah, that's that's all this is. It's uh <laughs> it's just you sitting here watching him write and every once in a while he talks and then it does eventually end at some point after like 20 minutes of him just sitting around and talking every now and then. Um, let's see. Isn't there a phrase like, are you new here?
This boss fight is really exciting. <laughs> I think she's new to this. I think she has no idea what's happening. I'm just going to stand here with her, and we're going to see if she disconnects or not. So Can't find the me too phrase. I don't think she knows that there's no boss fight or anything. I feel like she's going to disconnect before it all ends. Oh, man. So, uh, to go a little off topic, what do you guys think of the Toon HQ website letting people make, uh, um, field office groups, even though they're not even released yet? I think it's over now because for me it's 1229, so it's, uh, for me it's April 2nd, so. Guess I'm not fooling anyone. I know Mega Snoop uploaded a video on this, and he has, he got some dislikes, but, you know. It's kind of relaxing. It's like easy content. Like anyone that wants to make like like videos like on new content for Toontown, like just film yourself doing this. I had enough time to go to the bathroom and I started organizing things on my shelves. Went and talked to some folks around the house and I came back and it was still happening. But I swear, I'm gonna laugh so hard if that dog disconnects. I feel this secondhand, like, awkward humor, like me just standing next to the dog who has, like, no idea what's going on. So, uh, uh, do you guys ever think I'll make it to a thousand subs? Maybe. I gotta find a job. I used to work at my college until um, I graduated and then the pandemic hit and then everyone's lives were put on hold and everyone was getting laid off and uh, life is getting hard. That's crazy. Like, I had my spring break and, you know...
But yeah, um, I had a spring break, and when there was one day left of spring break, I was like, oh, I'm going to go back to college. And the pandemic wasn't, like, too, too bad. Like, it was starting to spread throughout the U.S. And then they were like, oh, nope, uh, we're going to extend your spring break for, uh, um, like, another week. And I was like, whoa, another week of spring break. That's cool, right? And, um, uh, you know, um, and I was just like, Oh, wait, is he going to say something? Yeah, so they extended it for another week, and I was like, oh my gosh, another week? That's awesome. Longer break. And then, um, by the time we were midway through that week, then they said it was, um, uh, they were going to extend it until the end of the month, which was like two more weeks. Um... And I was, I just like, I texted my parents, and I'm like, I'm like, hey, like, I'm not gonna, like, I can't believe it, I don't have like classes for for like the rest of the month, and they're like, no way, and I was just like, yeah, like, what am I gonna do with myself, like, just the idea that I would just spend an entire like, almost an entire month just sitting inside a house just playing games, I would have never imagined that, and then you know, classes eventually resumed like a little over a month later online and I barely got those done try taking ceramics online Yeah, there's never just not a reason behind anything. <laughs> He's just staring at us. Why is he just staring at us? He's not doing anything. Yeah, try. Yeah, so, anyways, try taking ceramics online and see how that goes. The teacher had no idea how to do that online. He made us, like, do research on other, like, potters and ceramics people, and, uh, he also, um, made us make things, like, out of paper, which I don't know if, like, folding paper into, like, formations counts as doing ceramics, because I think that's, like, making pots with clay and stuff, but maybe it does. Maybe you guys could tell me that. But then after that, like, I graduated college online, and, uh, mm. uh, some life. Now I've just been sitting inside trying to get jobs. And I tried to get one job, and they, they, they turned me down. I just, uh, I wasn't good enough, I guess. There were other people with, uh, more experience and qualifications, so to say didn't work out and now I'm trying to apply for another job and they have not reached out to me yet to do an interview so you may question why I'm talking about all this stuff it's because I gotta it's, something needs to happen other than just staring you know what I'm saying playing Super Mario uh, 3D World on the Switch plus Bowser's Fury. That's a pretty, pretty good game. Trying to go for 100% in both games, but it's pretty hard. But that's nice that they at least have content for the, you know, the hardcore completionists like me. Like, I beat the core game, I made it to the very end of the bonus world. I'm at the point now where I have to beat all the levels again on um, like all, like every single character, I don't want to spoil anything for those that are new to the game, but, um, yeah, that's like, you get the gold fl star flagpoles, got all the stamps, green stars, 
Uh, but now I have to repeat all the levels and get all the stamps and everything. Yeah. That's life. Oh, uh, that's life. Life is so much fun. What's that? Roman Holiday. I'm surprised the dog hasn't disconnected yet. <laughs> I, I would... Honestly... Oh, gosh. I wouldn't be surprised if, like, some people thought the game's softlock or something. Are these all just, like, reused assets? That's not a bad thing. Because it's just an April Fool's Day update. Did you hear that, uh... Um... Joey said on Twitter... Maybe I could find his, uh, Twitter page, actually. He said on Twitter, he said, like, he couldn't talk about certain things, but now he somehow can. Let's see if I could find the tweet. Joey, the leader of, uh... Where is he? I can't find him. Where's my... Jo where's Joey? Joey. I can't find him. What happened to my boy Joey? The one and only leader of Toontown Regretten, who I follow on Twitter. Which, I don't know why I do. I guess it's just the idea that, like... If he ever has anything to say, I might as well get to know it. Um. Yeah. Joey. Wow. See if there's anything new I can look at. If I type in Toontown Joey on Twitter, what comes up? Oh yeah, let's see what he has to say on here. Alright. Um Let's see. Oh yeah, they added the new games to the Toontown Rin. That's cool that they put in two new trolley games. I'll have to make videos on those. Oh yeah, he says sorry for the radio silence, Toontown fans. I've been busy with some exciting stuff at both Shell Games and Toontown this year, although I haven't been able to talk about either. For Toontown, at least, we'll be able to talk about a small part of our 2021 work very soon. Man, hopefully... Uh, that was on March 31st, by the way, when he said that. Um, oh, jeez. Man, where... When is... When are the field offices coming? <laughs> oh, man. I'm surprised this, this content that I'm trying to make right now is, like... It's not harder than I thought, but, like, I never thought I'd be just sitting here talking. Hmm. So be it. Oh yeah, what do you guys think about Mario's death? That's like been trending on Twitter like mad. I I can't believe this dog it like hasn't left yet. Like honestly, like I feel like if I didn't know what was happening, I would have left by then. Do I have a gag up squirt? Oh. <laughs> kind of sucks that you don't get any reward for doing this. Like, just sitting here for like 20 minutes. Like, I mean. I could easily see someone just farming that. Like, they go in, they get their stuff, and then they just leave, like, instantly. 
so be it. It's just dead radio silent. Do 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 do. That's a lot of money. Yeah, no problem, bro. So yeah, um, that's pretty much it for the COO, also known as the Chief Operating Officer. 
Do I get any ties at all? Because I don't recall there being any ties anywhere. Maybe I get a tie or something for, uh, I don't know. Backpack. Do I, I don't get any ties. No, I get absolutely nothing. That's pretty much it. But yeah, uh, this has been going on for 25 minutes, and now it's at 26 minutes, almost, in like 3 seconds. So yeah, uh, that's pretty much it for uh, Corporate Clash's new BoardBot HQ boss fight. I have been there. I have been to BoardBot's HQ. Oh wait, oh. BoardBot's. Oh. Oh, that's interesting. Alright, well yeah, uh, anyways, <laughs> I guess I'll see you guys in the next one. Um, yeah. Uh. Bye-bye.